Hey guys, what's going on? I'm going to go over the best school districts in Rapid City. Hey guys, what's going on? So my name is Christian Morrison, I'm a real estate agent in the Rapid City, Black Hills area. Got another video coming at you about the best school districts in Rapid City. This is a very highly uh, recommended video. So really quickly guys, if you're planning on moving here, you got any questions, uh, concerns, you wanna look at some properties, anything like that, feel free to reach out to me, call me, text me, email me, uh, hit me with a DM, write me an old fashioned letter if you're really feeling like it. Guys, I have people moving here every, almost every single day from out of town from this channel and I absolutely love working with you guys. You guys have all been awesome. So love to work with you, love to help you in any way that I can. All right, now that I've covered that, going into school districts here. I'm actually gonna flip you on to my computer screen so you can see what I'm talking about based off the map. All right guys, so here is, this is schooldigger.com, kind of shows you a map, map and how the schools rank. Um, so obviously green, you can see right here, green is the highest, red is the lowest. Um, so I'm gonna go through and show you kind of where they are and where the best schools are. So on the left here, it kind of tells you the rank out of the state, how many students, that type of thing. Um, so we go in, kind of the central area is Obviously, the lower rank schools in the red. The best side, if you take Rapid City down the middle right here, Highway 16, I kind of consider that the middle. If you take that down the middle and you go west, the west side is usually where everybody wants to be as far as the school districts go. Okay. So you got, uh, obviously, they're all kind of green over here. You got one E, which I believe is Canyon. Yep. Canyon Lake Elementary. So as the high school goes, you got Stevens High School, which last year was ranked the, high, the best high school in South Dakota. It's number seven overall. Uh, of schools in South Dakota. So a really good high school over there. With that, you got uh, Pinedale Elementary on that side as well, South Canyon Elementary. And then you got uh, West Middle School. This is Meadowbrook Elementary. And then Corral Drive. So again, all of those on the west side of town. Um, as far as the school districts go, sometimes it confuses me as far as the lines go. You can kind of see these drawn out lines here. They don't, I don't think those are the school district lines, but um, you can go to the uh, to the school district websites and figure out exactly where they are based off the house. But basically, if you're in West Rapid City, you're going to be in this, in these school district areas. Uh, the high school on the west side of town is always going to be Stevens. Uh, obviously, the elementary and middle schools can change a little bit here and there, uh, depending on where you live over here. But all of them, for the most part, are going to be uh, good schools. So if you kind of go in the center, um, if you're on the north side of Rapid City, the high school is Central High School. It's in the yellow. So, I mean, I don't, I have not ever heard bad things about it, but if you go off of this rating, it's going to be, you know, in that mid range school, not the best. And uh, the elementary schools up here, obviously not, uh, not ranked great. Horace Mann, uh, General Beetle, Millwood Heights Elementary, uh, and North Middle School. So all of those up there, you can kind of take the I 90 corridor. I'll kind of zoom in and show you what I'm talking about here, if I can get it. That I-90 corridor south of downtown, which is downtown, is right here. So anywhere from here up to the I-90 corridor and above, you're going to be in this school district here on the north side. Now, as far as the south side goes, sorry, this map's messing with me here a little bit. As far as the south side goes here, the high school for actually uh, when you're over here, if I'm not mistaken, I believe I'm right, is also central because uh, this high school is Rapid City High, which is like a... Um, different school. It's not a typical high school. Um, this other high school right here is, uh, that's actually not a high school. I don't know why that's in there, but oh, that's the school district building. That's what that is. Okay. Anyways, uh, going down here, uh, the other elementary schools, you got kind of in the oranges. You got a yellow down here for Grandview Elementary, Woodrow Wilson, decent school, South Park Elementary, decent as well. Um, and then on the south side, uh, south, south Middle School is the middle school over here. Now, if you kind of go east, uh, which is where a lot of the new developments happening, I made a video over here one time about a new development. This is also some decent schools. Um, my fiance is actually a substitute teacher. And she actually really likes these schools. So uh, this is going to be Rapid Valley um, or Valley, Valley View Elementary and then Rapid Valley Elementary right there. There's actually, I don't know why it's coming up on here, but there's Rapid Valley um, Middle School which I believe is the same rank. It's like in the same range, maybe a little bit closer to the green right next to Valley View Elementary. I don't know why it's not on there, but there's another one on there too. If you go out of outside of town a little bit, 
you got the uh, south or the sorry the northwest corridor of I ninety. You got Piedmont, Somerset, Blackhawk. This is a stage bar middle school is like very new school, really nice school, really high rated as well. Um, that's a really nice school. People really love that. I've heard great things about it. Uh, Blackhawk Elementary, and then you got I believe Piedmont Valley, yep, Piedmont Valley Elementary School there as well. Um, if you're in this area, your high school is actually this one right here, which is um, Sturgis High School. That's actually going to be the high school you'd be in if you're in that area. So it's about a 15 minute drive up there, but that's also a good rated school. If you go further east into Box Elder, that's where you got it's what's called Douglas School District. Oops. Sorry, guys. This thing is not as easy to work with as you might imagine. So anyways, okay, back into Box Elder. Box Elder, which is Douglas School District, actually has some really good uh, schools as well. So Douglas High School over there, um, Vandenberg Elementary, and then I don't remember what this middle school is. It's Douglas. Okay, Douglas Middle School. So I've heard great things about those as well. So just want to kind of give you a rough layout of where they are. So if you're looking at houses, if you're looking at moving here, those are kind of the difference in the areas and why that might matter for you if you're not looking at buying a house or if you're not don't have school age kids or anything like that is the resale value uh, resale value is going to be a little bit higher on the west side a little bit higher up in the blackhawk piedmont area and slightly higher in douglas than it would be on this north side of town um, you know what honestly the south side of town is about the same as the west but this north side of town for some reason is a little bit a little bit lower um, i think the school district has to do with that so Anyway, so wanted to give that to you guys really quick. We also do have a couple private schools I don't believe are showing up on here uh, either, but there is a, two private schools in town. There is a Rep City Christian High School, which is right about here uh, on the south side of town. And then there is, it might show up on here, let's see. Nope, it's not showing up on there either. But uh, right, at, right in this area as well, there is uh, a Catholic high school for uh for kids as well. So we have both of those options, kind of drawing a blank on the name of the Catholic school. St. Thomas More. The Catholic school name is uh, St. Thomas More. It's right out here on the south side of the, of the town as well. So anyways, that gives you all of the uh, schools. It kind of shows you a little bit of the layout of where they're at based off the map. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching this video. I appreciate you guys being here. Uh, again, if you've got any questions, if you're planning on moving out here, uh, you're thinking about moving out here, feel free to call me, text me, email me, write me an old-fashioned letter, write me on Facebook, Instagram, anything like that. Happy to help in any way that I can. Um, you guys have been moving out here a lot, and I really appreciate you guys. You guys have been awesome. Um, again, if you have any anything you think I should talk about, any topics you want me to hit, drop those in the comments. I read the comments, and I will make videos based off of those. So, All right, guys, see you on the next one.